Hello, this video provides instruction on replacing the Enphase Mobile Connect cell modem. The first step in replacing the cell modem is locating it. It's going to be installed either indoors or outdoors. If installed outdoors, it's likely installed within an IQ combiner box or one of the Enphase combiner boxes. It's often uh, going to be installed near the main service panel, uh, maybe near the solar equipment, and often inside of a combiner box. There's a few different generations of combiner boxes. This is the original IQ combiner box. It includes an Envoy. And if you have a, this kind of combiner box, the cell modem will be installed on the two black mounting tabs located here. If you uh, have this type of combiner box, you just unlatch it and open it and you will have your Envoy here, and your Enphase Mobile Connect cell modem installed on these two black plastic mounting tabs. Or you may just have a standalone Envoy mounted somewhere inside on a wall or within a, uh, a some other black, I'm sorry, gray plastic enclosure. And generally the cell modem is going to be installed to the USB port, one of the USB ports on the Envoy. Now it's rather straightforward to replace the cell modem. I want to show you this process. It's essentially the same for all of the cell modems. We just unplug the USB cable, we pull out the black plastic tabs from the base, and then we want to separate this tab. It comes in two parts. It comes with the head and a base. We're going to separate the base from the head here, and we're going to take the base and we're going to reinstall it inside of some pre-existing holes that are drilled into the combiner box. So once again, there's a base, the head and the base. I'm going to take the base, I'm going to remove it, and I'm going to install it inside the existing hole in the combiner box. And now I'm going to set aside the heads because I need to reuse both the base and the heads for mounting the new cell modem. So the new cell modem has arrived. This is a cell modem M1. It uh, operates on the 4G LTE M network. Inside of the package, there is a, um, a USB cable, an antenna, and also we have inside of here a metal mounting rod. A metal mounting rod. We also have a cell modem. Now the cell modem is inside of here. What we want to do is take the cell modem. We want to screw the antenna to the SMA connector here that says cell on it. We want to slide the metal mounting bracket into the back of it. There's a slot on the back of it. And then I'm going to take the head of these, this the head from the uh, black plastic mounting tab, and I'm gonna set the head in to the base. And that's what clips this into place. I'm gonna take the second head, slide it in, click it in place. We're all good here and I'm going to plug in the USB. When I plug in the USB, it begins to talk to this, the Envoy up here, and you'll see that uh, we immediately have a power light and a link light, and we start to get the signal strength indicators. This can take a minute for all of the information to uh, get sent, and then once it's communicating with the Envoy, this green button on the far left which has a cloud there's a black plastic uh, cloud um, you the cloud will become uh, green and that means that the system is now communicating with enlightened web-based monitoring system so that's it um, congratulations on your your new cell modem